Hey, Ryan Heaton here. I think this is update number 12. And I want to apologize about the audio and video quality. I am away. I'm traveling. I am at the beautiful Pensacola Christian College. They've brought me in as a guest for a couple days, which is awesome. And I'm in like the world's largest furniture store. Actually, it's, a, it's their coffee shop. Just watching all these great Christian students. It's pretty cool. Um, I got some awesome Simple Church Tools news to share with you. Our sermons tool is almost, at least the back end of it, is almost finished. And so I can start to show you what that's going to look like. Um, so basically what you'll do is you will add your series on the series tab. And you can just add the series. So let's say I am. And these are the I am statements. Okay. And then... Uh, you know, you can put some content here. And we're working on, you know, several bugs here. You can put a featured image and then just hit create. And uh, that's how that works. So uh, same thing works with speakers. It's just a matter of clicking add speaker, adding the information. And then in the sermons, uh, what you do is hit this add sermon, give it a title, pick the series, pick the speaker put the Bible text in, we're gonna change this to a smaller field. And then the content can actually be marked down. And so you can just copy and paste uh, co content in here and use this bar to format it. But you could also, if you use a tool like Bear or IA Writer, or there's a whole bunch of these uh, Dropbox paper to write out your messages, you can just copy and paste your entire manuscript into here. And I'll show you. I mean, go into Bear here and grab it's my sermon from Sunday morning. I can go in here and paste this in and it's going to take and make it uh, very nicely formatted when on the front end. Now as far as the audio, we need to change these icons, but it's just a matter of dragging and dropping a file from one to the other. So let's see here. Um, I'm just looking for an MP3 file. Maybe it's in the desktop. There we go. So there's the file for this. So I'm just going to drag and drop. And alternatively, you can click on this and it will bring up your message there. So I'm going to grab the walk in the spirit. Boom. All right. Now this is where the bug is going to show up. When I hit create, it's not going to work. But I just wanted to show you what this is going to look like so that you have some idea of how easy this is to use. Um, tried to make it as easy as possible and still some bugs to work out but uh, pretty excited about this. Also exciting, we've got a bunch of new backers and I wanna say thank you for that. And I uh, look forward to having some awesome stuff. There's a whole lot of awesome stuff being worked on this week. Can't wait to show it to you in the next couple of days.